for joining my presentation today. I'm Masashi Hamahira from Japan, senior manager at Square Enix. I'm not good at speaking English very well, but I will do my best. Please listen, thank you. Today, I will talk about usage of MySQL at Square Enix. Part of our cloud platform and my expectations for MySQL. Let me start with video of Mobius Final Fantasy, a mobile RPG made by the team behind the Final Fantasy series with 10 million players worldwide. <laughs> you can play this game at your mobile phone, smartphone. This game <coughs> is also learning on my SQL and my team is managing it. I joined Square Enix in 2007. I've been playing many games created by Square Enix and today. I manage an infrastructure team for those games too. Square Enix is best known for role-playing video games including Final Fantasy, Dragon Quest, Dragon Warrior, and Kingdom Hearts with Disney. Our corporate philosophy is this. Our headquarters in Tokyo, Japan, <coughs> is in Tokyo, Japan. We also have branch offices in the United States, Europe, and China. We operate games globally. Our development team is located across the globe. My team at Square Enix is called C. Which stands for Social Game Infrastructure Group. We are responsible for development and management of our online games infrastructure. Here are the highlights of my team. We manage over 9,000 servers of which 3,000 are MySQL servers. 
these numbers run more than 100 games are running. We refer to games as project. Online games at Square Enix are not only games on smartphones, we deliver games for web browsers too. Games on gaming and consoles are also connected online and players can collaborate with each other. Square Enix Bridge is one of the core systems for players. Players can manage in-app purchases with this Square Enix Bridge. Also, Square Enix Bridge is used to backup players' data and to transfer data to other devices, like when you purchase a new smartphone. For most projects, Square Enix needs these functions. We, the Chig team, prepare these functions as a common platform for our company. Our main responsibility is managing backend services of over 100 projects, including cloud-based infrastructure and middleware. <coughs> of course, MySQL is a key component we manage. Each project can reach 800,000 QPS in database and about 6 gigabit per second data transfer among servers. Let me explain more about this in later slides. We sometimes analyze and improve server-side applications. We do this to reduce operation costs by reducing workload of servers. <coughs> Eight years ago, when I joined Square Enix, I needed to, to I needed to manage infrastructure of online games. At this time, I managed only one game named Sengoku Iksa, a web-based strategy game. You are a samurai warrior and explore through chapters. Now. I have a team of 30 plus members and manage over 100 projects today. Each member is subject matter expert for each domain. Like Takahide Nojima, right picture, uh, who is one of the core members of the Debian community in Tokyo. I only select technical experts for my team. My team members are handling more than five projects each. They sometimes work at the technical directors of projects. I also invest my time to prepare technical documents for projects like guidebook <coughs> or performance testing. This helps project teams to adapt new technologies and development methods. We are currently using three cloud infrastructures. Nifty Cloud, AWS, Google Cloud Platform. Mainly Nifty Cloud, which is operated by a subsidiary of Fujitsu and others. One of the major challenges for my team now is system overload. Some titles can get a much larger number of users than expected or planned, which is generally good news 
but sometimes large numbers cause performance problems that we spend hours to resolve. Shing team is managing the launch of multiple projects each week. If two incidents happen at the same time, it can become a serious situation. I wish that human resources were as elastic as the cloud. Let me share plans and strategies around our cloud usage. As I mentioned earlier, we are mainly using EFT Cloud and AWS Google Cloud Platform. We are using multiple clouds largely because of direction from our management. We want to keep strength in price negotiation with service providers and diversify risks. So what is next? The keyword is global. Worldwide users are finding matching players globally and accessing the same games from physically remote locations. This brings new requirements, multi master database with low latency between regions. Of course, latency of mobile network is major concern for game players, while our team focuses on server-side issues. We are currently testing several different options. I hope that the new MySQL-based cloud service from Oracle can meet our requirements too. Major cloud providers are releasing new services possibly fulfill our requirements. Through some of those are still pretty version, we will examine details of those services together with engineers from each cloud vendors, which can help us to overcome technical difficulties of those services. Next topic is how Square Enix is using MySQL. This is the typical configuration of our online games. The numbers here are from one of our major games which is using MySQL. In this game, there are 20 words. What here means chapters or stages in game. At the peak period, over 6,500 players are online in this game. But this number is only in one world. Total number of users playing at the same time can reach over 130,000. Network traffic from users can reach over 80 megabits per word. 1.6 gigabits for all 20 words. And traffic between servers can be 1 gigabits in each word, which means 20 gigabits <coughs> in total. We are using MySQL application these MySQL servers in each 140,000 read and write queries per second. The total number of transactions of this game is 800,000. We are using MySQL application, these MySQL servers in, uh, sorry, uh, again, this is just one of the game we have. We are managing over 100 games right now. As you know, 
in Japan, we most prepare for catastrophic disasters like huge earthquake and tsunamis. Those disasters can destroy dead centers. That's why disaster recovery is mandatory for all business critical systems. Our games are critical for our business. Last year, over 5 million people living in Hokkaido, the northern island of Japan, experienced an island-wide blackout for 48 hours which was triggered by a large quake. There are 10 major data centers in Hokkaido, and most of them successfully booted generators, but not 100% perfect. This is one example of a real-world scenario. For disaster recovery, we are utilizing MySQL replication. Once the server receives transactions, it replicates to another slave learning at the different data center. In this example, one data center is located in eastern Japan, and another one is in western Japan. my expectation for future versions of MySQL beyond MySQL Edge. Our current use case requires a lot of manual operations every time we set up new MySQL instances. If we use the path, for example, AWS Aurora, GCP, Google Platform, Particularly in database as a service, we wouldn't need it. I hope MySQL will provide more automated configuration in future. MySQL 8 comes with a new parameter named InnoDB Delegated Server. I hope this parameter evolves, like tuning parameters dynamically based on hardware resource usage. Then I wouldn't have to tune parameters in my .com anymore. That brings us to the end of the presentation. Thank you so much for your interest, interest and attention. Please find our online games on app stores. When playing those, you will remember those games are learning on MySQL. Thank you. So we have a push, push up. Yeah. We have a few minutes for questions, maybe? Translation. Okay. So does anybody have any questions? Uh, thank you for the presentation.